Hello everyone, my name is Debashish and I welcome you all to this video. So in one of our last videos, we have seen how to instrument some exported APIs using Frida instrumentation engine. So in today's video, we are going to see how to uh, instrument some unexported APIs using Frida instrumentation engine. Uh, so for this, we are going to resolve the API address using uh, debugging symbol. So since we will be debugging a Microsoft product, uh, we can actually download those symbol from symbol server uh, that is already publicly available. Uh, so let's get started. So first I'll show you this, uh, the API that I'm going to instrument. Uh, so we are going to instrument JavaScript, one of our JavaScript API, which is uh, unexported. Uh, so I'll show you exactly which one I'm going to uh, the module where the API actually resides is JScript9. Uh, JScript9, JScript9. Yes, JScript9.dll. And the API, the unexported API that we are going to instrument is called ATAN2. ATAN2. So this is the API that we are going to instrument. Uh, in IDA Pro, uh, it is utilizing Microsoft symbol. So that is why you are able to see that API name, but actually it is unexported API. You should not be able to see any symbol. If you have watched my last video, you should be uh, quite familiar with this particular script. So here we are actually, will add the PID here. And in this section, we are going to add our JavaScript code that will be injected into the process, IE process for instrumentation. So let's, you know, write this code. So the first thing that you have to do, you have to load the debugging symbol. So this is how you do it. Debug symbol dot load. And you have to enter the DLL name, which is a script nine dot DLL. After that, you have to do debug symbol. Name. You have to enter it like this, your script and the API name. Just copy it here. Chase math and two. This should be good enough. We'll remove it. Yeah. Now it is going to return the address. So let's create a address. This console dot log address. Now you have to we have to write the interceptor. So now what you have to do, we have to write the enter function. We'll just print it here, console.log. We are inside J script nine math it and two so this code should work so let's try it on i let's we will have to open internet explorer and we'll have to inject our script into the sandbox process which the PID is 1864 so we'll just you know add it here 1864 
and we need a uh, javascript uh, file, uh, we need a javascript code to trigger this particular function so i have already written it i'm going to show uh, so this html file will actually eventually trigger uh, this uh, math.82 function as you can see i am using math.82 uh, function we are co i am calling this math.82 function from javascript so it should eventually go to javascript uh, jscript 9.dll and this math.82 function uh, so to be able to trigger that we'll have to load this in our uh, in our internet explorer browser so i'll just open it now this is test uh, file.html from desktop i'll open file okay so i have already opened it now i'll attach it attach our script to this process let's confirm that 8780 it has changed so i'll have to change it again 8780 780 okay now we will just run this python test.py what it is saying uh, unable to find function name in jscript 9 with 10 to okay i have missed that i have you know misspelled it so jscript 9 i have to make now it should work so basically what we have what i have done i have made a small mistake here i have to make the e capital so now if we just you know launch internet explorer again open that javascript file and we'll attach to this process which is 4156 4156 and if you just execute this and as you can see we have the address of uh, math 8 and 2 function now if you refresh here you should be able to see that we are inside jscript 9 math 8 and 2 function so we have successfully uh, hooked into that function and uh, in the same way you can actually uh, iterate through all the arguments that are being passed to that function using so that's all i wanted to discuss in this video i hope you have enjoyed uh, so if you are not subscribed to this channel please do subscribe because i'll be uploading a uh, few other videos on friday as well in this same series so thank you for watching bye bye